Okay guys, I just got a play.com package in the mail and uh, as you can see here, it's a steelbook and uh, it's a play.com exclusive and I think it's region free so I'll open this up and show you right now it's the Shutter Island play.com exclusive first thing to mention, play.com's packaging is great and uh, they've gone with this foam padded layer for the steelbook to sit cosily in and I'm really hoping other retailers follow in this so yeah, um, this is Martin Scorsese, Shutter Island, starring Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh, it's a Play.com exclusive for the Paramount Centenary collection. Okay, so once the padding's off, you'll find the steelbook. It's uh, it's almost glossy, but it's kind of matte as well. I, d I can't really tell what to describe the texture as, but as you can see, it is quite shiny as I pass it by the light. Um, it has a cardboard back cover which I'll go through in a second and it, it is quite easily take, taken off and also these stickers right here, the certificate stickers are removable okay so I've taken off the certificate sticker and I've uh, taken off the, the cardboard backing it was held on with glue, this type of glue right here and um, I'll show you the back okay so the back is quite a, quite a heavy duty cardboard quite um, and here you got a review, nice picture banner, and this picture of uh, Leo here, which is on the back of the actual still look I'll show you in a minute. A synopsis of the film, and the special features, details, and specs. Okay, so the front cover, as I said before, I don't know how to best describe the um, the texture of the front. As I said, it's kind of like a half gloss, half matte finish, which sounds odd, but it looks great. So we've got the Collector's Edition, Martin Scorsese film, Leonardo DiCaprio, Shutter Island, and uh, this disjointed, as you can see from the waves, island picture, all printed onto the front, on this kind of nice grey, blue, teal kind of uh, coloured background. Very nice. Okay, so the spine. Here you can see the Shutter Island logo and Collector's Edition uh, text printed on, Blu-ray logo and the Paramount logo here. And here's the back. As I said, uh, it has the Leo's picture from the back of the cardboard on there and the picture banner. There's Michelle Williams, Ben Kingsley, Mark Ruffalo and same characters, just uh, different pictures. And uh, here we got the Paramount logo, little trademark sentence, and another little number sequence there. Nice. Okay, to start off with the inside, I would just like to mention this is a Paramount film, so it does have a pictureless disc. And just to cl clear some confusion, um, Paramount have started to do picture discs, but however, this is an old Blu ray uh, disc design, so it, it is pictureless. However, Paramount have started to do pictures just to clear the confusion. Okay so with this still book there is internal artwork which I'll show you now. The back has the uh, picture from the poster with Leo with the match. That's behind the disc. And here we have a photo montage. Very nice. Okay so with the special features we've got two features here. Behind the shutters which follows the film through its inception, which is ironic because of Leo, uh, as an acclaimed novel to the big screen, which is in HD, and Into the Lighthouse, a historic psycho therapies of the uh, 1950s feature, which is also HD. Okay, so the film comes in 1080p anamorphic widescreen with English HD, uh, DTS HD 5.1 audio, French Dolby Digital uh, 5.1, uh, the subtitles are English, Danish, Dutch, Finnish, French, Norwegian, Swedish, and the running time is 138 minutes. Okay, so that's the uh, Shutter Island Play.com exclusive uh, for the Paramount Centenary collection. Uh, it's a really great set, it's really beautiful, and um, I'm very glad to have this in my collection. I haven't obviously seen the uh, Blu-ray transfer or audio because you just saw me take out its packaging. But I did love the film. It's uh, criticised by some for not being Martin Scorsese's best, but 
I, I really enjoyed it. It's not his best, but it's a great film. So uh, thank you for watching. See you next time.